Um, just a lot of frustration. Uh, obviously getting so close and not coming away again with a, with a win. Um, simple story, but yeah, very frustrating. Just a few things that we could have done better, obviously moving forward and, and obviously still got a lot of tournament to play yet, but um, yeah, another one that got away, so. Just talked about uh, earlier on the week. Talks about um, how emotional, how meaningful it is for you to play for Scotland, and you know you see, you see them come out to a fantastic event, like you say. And I mean, you've obviously you've had a, a 90 odd caps now. Is it still the same when you come out to the money field? It's just getting better. Uh, that's all I can say. Um, and obviously, the closer I come to reti well, retirement, I learned as little retirement, the more it means to me because the, t the time is limited. And I I've definitely noticed a difference in the crowds over the years. They're, they're, they're getting better. And, I know it's just the success of the pro teams in Scotland and they're getting bigger, we're getting bigger crowds of both both pro teams which I think is starting to reflect here and also I think it shows that the crowd are now starting to see where this team's going. We're improved from the summer through the autumn and although we've been not winning the Six Nations, we've been damn close and again was the, I think the, the fans are seeing that and, and that's what's making them come out and I think last weekend was a sellout. I think, um, the Ireland game to sell out, and we're hoping that the England game will be the same again. So it's a great place to be in. As a Murrayfield is a fantastic uh, stadium, especially the crowds behind you singing. And uh, what more can you say?